Hello viewer, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Martha Aching with another video. Today we're going to prepare fresh fish from scratch. Somebody requested for this and I thought I'd make this video today. Without further ado, let's get into it. Now when you're scaling your fish, please avoid this direction. It makes it hard to scale the fish. Face it down like so is when it becomes easier to remove the scales. Focus everywhere. Ensure you're removing all the scales. Yeah. By the way, it gets very slippery and that's why I've chosen to do this without water. You scale the fish uh, both sides. The head is not also left out. You also scale that part too. I'm doing this outdoors because I want to fry from outside and it's easier. I don't want the smell in the house and the dirt everywhere. So you look for this hole, the umbilical cord, and then you cut across like so. This will enable you to remove all the dirt from the stomach. So you ensure you clear everything out. Yep, we are done. So I'll continue this. For the rest of the fish when i'm done i now begin cleaning them thoroughly with water focus on also on the gills like this press and remove any excess dirt or blood and then round the fish you clean Then we place it in another bowl of clean water. So you remember, you clean the gills and you press as you clear it like that. Then round the head, you clear yep and also inside then place in clean water and so we'll continue doing this for the rest of the fish after you're done cleaning them well you place them onto this uh, karak so that they can drip and dry. You do not want to fry fish that is wet. When they are dry, we now cut like so. This will enable the oil to penetrate in well so that the fish is well done when frying. Then you cut across like so. This still helps to get the fish well done when frying. And 
later on we are going to separate them into pieces it's easier for me this way especially when it comes to storing Oh, by the way, you only cut like this uh, if maybe you want to fry. It's optional. If you want to cook it fresh, then there's no need per se to do this. So now I'm making the pieces. And that's the head. Get the head, the waist, and the tail. So... It's cut into three portions for storage. Now we're cutting the waist. So we put salt to help reduce the flies. When you put salt, of course flies are not a fan of salt, so they'll decrease. And also you must put salt before frying. So now they're frying. And I've used a karai here, which is easier for me. And this is how they look like after frying. For more videos like this, please subscribe. Bye.